uh, before they will have the significant degree and all the other things? Do you think it will take a long time before they actually can enter? Okay, that's why I'm not signing an agreement for it to be better faster, earlier. So, but what okay, can if we sign an agreement now, now, Russia will become a member earlier then. I think uh, everyone benefits from it. All right, Karina. Um, what are the main benefits of Russia and from the WTO? Oh, okay. Uh, you should listen when I speak. I, I told that Russia can't impose uh, higher taxes, so uh, we have uh, like we, we, Russia is a very important uh, leader. Of, uh, for example, we import oil from it, so I don't know uh, Russia can't impose I don't know, higher taxes, so we benefit from it. Um, there are a lot of big and really important and countries member of the WTO. Uh, why do you think it's necessary that the Great Petronia is starting to support Russia to get a member when the big countries refuse to get uh, like Russia into the WTO? Actually the biggest country uh, signed an agreement but they want Russia to become a member. So everyone wants for Russia to become a member. It's you just a very long time. It's, I don't know. It's a, it's a very long time for you to become a member of WTO. That's the reason why it's not a member. Even USA supports it. So. Um, do you know of the exact countries that are against Russia getting into the WTO? Oh, uh, actually, not idea. really. I, 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 as uh, at the teleconference, for example, okay. uh, everyone told that nobody is against it, but it's a very long time. Okay. Okay. Okay, thank you. Uh, are there anyone who hasn't asked a question yet that would like to ask for? Marco. Uh, since the only question uh, of the dispute between Ukraine and Russia is now solved, uh, do you believe that uh, what benefits does the Great Petronian nation have from uh, from Russia now, except the uh, taxes? I mean, if they are accepted to the WTO, what benefits do they have? Okay, so. Uh uh, also, uh, we will, I don't know, like, um, for example, like you were told to like, reveal the information. Yeah, I rejected Russia, um, the Russian Federation 10 years ago, between 10 years ago was 98, there was no Soviet Union that time. Uh, when we, did, uh, where we rejected the Russian Federation to enter um, the WTO 10 years ago, there are still uh, major human rights violations and some critics say the progress is going back. Like, what do you think has changed in the time that we actually would actually make us to join, let new the Russian Federation join? Okay, I understand. Actually, we didn't reject anything. And the second part is, uh, it kind of took a long time because in many one, uh, I don't know, a lot of Ten years ago, isn't it? Okay. Um, I know. I just wanted to tell that. Uh, a Soviet Union uh, was uh, like 10 to kids. And it takes a long time for it to come around to pass this period. And that's why we didn't want to, like, the Soviet Union was, uh, I don't know, like, it doesn't exist anymore. And we just want to join this year WTO. Mm -hmm. so. The economy, uh, okay, so the information, uh, for example, uh, Russia has made uh, steps regarding the lack of information, for example, and democracy, because it's, I don't know, it's, uh, uh, how to say it, uh, it's more, uh, the information is, uh, isn't so prohibited, like it was 20 years ago. And we must support that. The Federation into its circles. I believe this is actually wrong. That we, Great Petronium, should support this thing. Uh, the reason why I believe this is wrong is very simple. Uh, the Russian Federation is still making progress in terms of human rights and other problems. As we agreed before, we have the information pack, which is which will help us very much and help the Russian uh, the Russian Federation to grow and take up steps to 
um, to abolish the human right, uh, human rights, um, human rights uh, problem they have. But the thing is, I believe that we still should make, uh, shouldn't uh, allow. Aye. Aye. All opposed, nay. That motion clearly passes, and now we are voting for the resolution. Russian entrances of the WTL, so uh, let's vote on that. All in favor of the resolution, please raise your hands. Sign up for one This is the first time I've done this. My hand is up. <laughs> All right, and the bill clearly, the resolution, sorry, clearly passes. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. How could we actually have 13? Uh, to congratulate the individuals, the parliamentarians that have worked so hard to make certain that our great country not only runs, but runs effectively. But as we noticed, there uh, uh, a few bills passed, one resolution passed, so maybe the wheels of governmental justice uh, move a little slow, but that's okay, because that inspires debate. And I take this personal point of privilege to, to, to make the opportunity, to take the opportunity to recognize each and every single one of you for not only uh, a wonderful parliamentary session, but a wonderful three weeks in general. Three and a half weeks, so forth. Uh, and I want to offer my congratulations as a humble parliamentarian from uh, the Southeast Petronian Party of Peasants uh, to uh, offer my congratulations for your wonderful completion of the Ben Franklin Program.